How's it going guys? Kels Prime here and we are back with another Anthem video. With the Anthem public demo coming thick and fast, for many of you it will be the first time you get to play Anthem, so this short video is your guide to making the right choices and to getting the most out of the demo this weekend. So without further ado, I think it's time to start. Actually, before I do that, do you guys think I'm obsessed with the Colossus? I'm reading my obsession with the great and majestic, amazingly brilliant, beacon of hope, humanity's last avenger, society saviour and a bringer of light colossus has somehow clouded my judgement. Clearly this isn't the case, right? Of course not. No, no. Of course not. Right, on with the video. So here are my 5 top tips to get you started. Number 5. Unlock your first javelin. You start the demo at level 10 and the option to pick one other javelin for non-VIP members is at level 12. You can pick only one javelin, so make sure you pick the right one. So let's go through the javelins briefly. The ranger you'll get by default, so I'll let you experience that for yourself. The storm is the mage of the four javelins, hovering and using elements harvesting the power of the anthem to wield elemental magic. It's also the primer king, but no colossus. The Javelin is a fan favourite for being a glass cannon, it unleashes a hell of a lot of damage in a short space of time. The Interceptor is the ninja of the four Javelins, the Warframe clone as I like to put it. It's fast, nimble, close quarter combat, being hand to hand and a great support class with its combo ability priming all targets within range. Finally, the Colossus, the brute of them all, the only Javelin to wield heavy weapons and give off great explosions of the physical kind. With a couple mod components, you'll be right at home. If you want to know more about abilities, combos and elements, I'll leave a link in the description below for you to have a watch because it is important. Number 4. Missions are a one time thing. Enjoy them, and then complete multiple strongholds to hit level 15 to start dropping the better rated gear. You want to hit 15 as soon as possible and the strongholds is the best way to do this. Number 3. Inscriptions are still bugged, but learning your primers and detonators are important. I have a guide for this, link in the description below also, and yes they make a long fight turn into a short fight, so it's something you're going to want to learn, and if you do enjoy Anthem and plan on picking it up after you've played the demo, you're definitely going to want to learn how to use primers and detonators. In theory it's not difficult at all, however learning the skills and learning what they do and how they work is very important. Number 2. Unlike Destiny and Division, you do not see the items you pick up till the end reward screen. You are also unable to change your gear until you return back to the hub in Fort Tarsus. So make sure you pick the correct loadout when you're heading out, because if you don't and you want to change, you'll have to go back to the hub and change at the hub through the forge. The items you pick up are not limitless. You can hold I believe 24 items that you can also track in your tracked menu. I don't have an image for this. I am sorry, but from what I'm told, you can hold up to 24 items that you pick up in the open world. So if you're playing in free play and are nearing full, end the expedition, get your loot and then head back in. Number 1. This one is actually quite important. The highest rated gear and abilities are not always the best to use. Read what the ability is and what it does. Sometimes 115 gear score will be better than 119 because it can combo or it just has stats more relevant to what your javelin is. Bonus tip, this Sunday afternoon Bioware has promised an event in game for this demo. What time that is is still anyone's guess however, but make sure you're there because I've promised it's going to be good. And finally, the second bonus tip, have mercy on the grabbits. They give you no XP. 2 million was slaughtered in the last demo, no this is not a challenge, have mercy on their souls. Well that's my top 5 tips, I hope this was useful and will give you a head start when you start playing the demo on 1st of February. If you found this useful drop a like, subscribe and most importantly please share, it allows the video and channel to gain a much broader exposure helping both to grow. Until next video, remain legend.